highlights this week. We launched our Green New Deal Fund this week. This will invest in lowering carbon emissions here in the north of Tyne, while also creating jobs. Investments will be in a whole range of schemes between £200,000 and £2 million. Community energy generation, electric vehicle charging points, uh, building retrofit to save energy, small scale renewables, low carbon heating and projects to restore nature. Best of all, it's a recyclable fund. So it will give projects the capital they need and then when they're operational, they'll repay the fund so we can support even more projects. I want this fund to grow and grow. On Tuesday, we held our cabinet meeting. We've agreed our future high streets investment. Our good work pledge now protects 20,000 working people and growing. We agreed our adult education program for next year. This year, despite COVID, we've created over 25,000 adult and education enrolments. Everything from languages to lorry driving to training as a chef. And over 4,000 of the enrolments were in community spaces in places like Annick, Amble, Berwick, Rothbury, Pegswood, Morpeth, Wooler, Hexham, Holtwhistle, Whitley Bay. Uh, I'm sure I've missed a few. Uh, and my thoughts go out to everyone who's still suffering without electricity. We need a major review of the resilience of our grid. The owners of these companies are making very large profits which need to be reinvested into guaranteeing people a reliable electricity supply. See you next week.